Hey, this is Bjorn Rebney, CEO and Chairman of Bellator MMA. You're watching ProMMANow.com. Hey guys, Dan Wolfman from ProMMANow.com with Akop Stepanyan. Good. Good, all right. How's it going? Thank you. We grappled earlier today quite a bit. Thank you very much. Thank you. Which is pretty amazing. You know, you didn't know who I am. I walk into the gym. I'm, I'm 100 kilo, 220 pounds, and, and you're fighting at uh, 145. So, you know, we had some pretty good scrapping going on, considering I'm twice your size. Right? Now, you came from a long striking background, a lot of kickboxing titles and taekwondo titles. What do you, what do you tell us about that? What are some of these titles you have? Well, I've been very long in the field of the field of taekwondo. Please tell me about the types of sports that I've been doing and I've been doing success. I started doing sports in 6 years. My father was interested in sports and I've been doing sports. Постепенно э, я начал уже в секцию переходить тэквондо, в 12 лет начал заниматься тэквондо. Э, э, была цель э, превзойти всех спортсменов, э, которые были там в зале, и выполнить мастера спорта. Выполнил там мастера спорта, э, выиграл чемпионат России и перешел плавно на кикбоксинг, так как э, захотелось что чего-то более жесткого. В кикбоксинге тоже добился результатов, выиграл Россию, на Европе, выиграл Европу и почувствовал, что не хватает техники рук, боксерской техники, и перешел на бокс. И потихонечку и я каждый вид спорта, как бы, можно сказать, испробовал, и сейчас мастер спорта по пяти видам, и я думаю, последние три года я Занимаюсь самбо и просто я должен был перейти в смешное единоборство, так как э, это здесь э, высовокупность всех видов спорта, всех единоборств и э, решил испробовать именно в этом виде спорта. Uh, well, I uh, started training when I was six years old. Actually, my dad made, uh, made me uh, uh, interested in sports, and I st uh, my first sport was taekwondo. And my goal was to be to be better than anybody in my gym. And uh, so, uh, first I won the championship of Russia in my, my master of sport black belt. And after that, I thought that I want something tougher, so I started training kickboxing. And then I won the championship of Russia in kickboxing and the championship of Europe in kickboxing. Then I figured that uh, I, don't, I don't think that I am quite confident in my uh, budget. So I started training boxing and became the champion of Moscow in boxing. And, and now I am a, have a degree of master of sport in five different types of sport. And the next challenge for me is MMA. So now I'm training, training MMA professionally for a few years. And uh, it's uh, quite a challenge. And I think MMA is like a top, top combat sport in the world because it's, it has everything in it. And I really, really want to be the best in the world. In this he's o how long? He's only been training grappling a few years? Three, three years. Wow, you, <laughs> you learn very fast. You know, you have good throws and very good days for, for just a few years I of training. Try. То есть из чего три года тренируешься в борьбе, то есть ну, делается время, что ты не понял, впечатлилось уже. Да, с so many masters of sport, do you think about coaching when you're older, when they ever retire? А учитывая твой опыт, думаешь о том, чтобы начать тренировать потом, когда уже не станешь выступать, может быть, все? Ну, я думаю, как бы каждый спортсмен в дальнейшем, чтобы остаться в форме, там, тренирует, будет почувствовать атмосферу спортсмена, спорт. Так что я, наверное, uh, now you're you're fighting a very big name in Marlon Sandro in the opening of the tournament, I believe February seventh. Yes. Um, what do you think about taking on such a you know a big name in, in the sport? I'm trying not to think. I'm not thinking about the uh, about 
in the history of the mission. I think that uh, everybody, all the fighters are human, Every, uh, everybody is very strong and big size. And uh, I, when I'm thinking about our fight, I, I'm going to get in there and will try to do my best to win. That's what I'm going to do. Okay, and say something to the fans and people you want to get to know. Значит, всем российским болельщикам и фанатам, тем, кто вообще поддерживает меня, спасибо. Значит, надеюсь, что оправдаю надежды и покажу интересный бой. И всем американским болельщикам хочу сказать, что есть большое желание, чтобы здесь тоже появились много болельщиков и людей, которые поддерживают меня. Uh, well, I, I want to uh, thank all the Russian fans for their support and I would try mm -hmm. not to disappoint you. And I want to tell you, American guys, that uh, I hope that after watching uh, me, fight, uh, me fight on uh, February 7th against Marlon Sandro, uh, you guys will recognize me and you will be rooting for me in the future and I will have uh, a lot of American fans as well. Absolutely. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you, Alexei. Yeah,